So, in today's video I'm going to be carving this massive pumpkin. I've got a few tools. I have my design that won't stick on if my pumpkin's still wet. I did dry it but it's still a bit damp. So when it's dried I'm going to carve my design out and stick that on. I've got some paper to try and dry it. I've got a, I'm going to put some guts into here. But then I'm also going to gut the middle. And I've also got a bag as well. And I'm going to time lapse the part where I gut it out. Trying to decipher. I knew it was really flimsy, I knew it wasn't going to last long. That bit I don't think is going to come out. Actually. You also have to get something with a good top that you can pull it in and out. But mine's a bit soggy so it might fall off. What I was going to do is sat down, but it's harder to um, do it sat down. Mm. You make your dents and then you go through with your knife. I've still got the pic, I found the picture from last year. I've still got it, so I might put that. I did basically a bat, and I did a star, and then I did a few, and then I did a moon, I think. It's not going to look quite as good as this year. You always have to, um, you have to improve, I guess. You always have to do an improve, an improve. And I also remember the lid last year being... Little last year being pretty small. I could barely get my hand in it. Never comes out first time, so just let me learn. I am about three quarters of the way around now. And I will definitely time lapse some of the some of the bits that take. the world's longest video ever if I don't my video last year was almost half an hour I do believe the stars aren't as big anymore now but it is the last I think I'm going to work out my watch because I'm that will work out because I'm moving my hands so much. Now I've gone all the way around but I need to make sure the hole is massive compared to last year. There's a bit here that doesn't look very carved -y. not coming out. So 
half of it's hanging out. Now we just have to try and get the other half too. I've done it. Oh my goodness gracious me. The amount of guts. The amount of guttage we have to do. This is going to take a while. So I might press pause on this. On the filming. I'll show you my... It's a nice little lid. And I'll show you my design up close. And then I'll pause you for... Um, well, for me to... Gut this. But that's my design. I might time lapse it. Time lapse it in a bit. But that's my design for now. And I'll see you in a bit. I've made more progress to the scooping out. The yucky part. So here's the progress so far. That's all. So if you can vaguely see, it says half P, but you haven't like haven't like pushed it through yet. But I started there, but I'm gonna half P. Over here, I've got a bat that needs pushing through, and then all I've got to do now is carve Halloween around the bottom, and then it's complete. I'll do a bit more, and then I'll just keep giving you that like updated progress. I'm actually, at the point where. I've carved it all, we've got to like push it all through and all I've got left is the E, E and the N I've done one of the bats over here and I've got another one to go over there and then I'll put like my multiple spider in or light or whatever in the middle and then you can see it all lit up but as you can tell I started pushing it through and then I realised just to carve it and then start pushing everything through at the end so I'll sit you down and we can carve the rest of this out yeah. So I've only got this little bit here, as I explained, left, and then I'm going to hopefully push it all through. I'm sat down this time because it's easier, and I do need to concentrate because I can talk at the same time. Who knew? I think of. Yeah, and you can actually carve it through. There's no way I can do this without a stencil because I'm not. That's good, and all these lovely guts. I've actually only got 10 minutes left, I need to speed up a notch. It gets dark early in these days, so running's got to begin early. Yeah, I ran out of sellotape, so I'm on blue tap, but you can't actually cut through the blue tap. Well, you can go through the sellotape. You need a steady hand. I did just rewatch my last video to see which bits I showed you, and I showed you basically all of it. Um, and it was 25 minutes long. I actually did some Halloween decorating in my last video as well. I think I've done the E on top of each other. I've done the E a bit too close. Actually, no, I haven't. I'm actually going to rip off the E as well. But when you cut through it, it's like cut through. So, I'm now going to stick this end on not too close. Get that carved out. Get the last bat carved out. Get it all pushed through. Get a light in it. And we are done. Basically, you get a light. I'm going to put a light in it straight away. If I've got time now, or I might have to do it later. This end's looking a bit. Actually, I don't know what I'm missing. I'm missing. I'm missing the line down here. So I've done that end now. I did have two bats 
Let's do the bat. Say I have two bats, I cut it out. Don't know whether I have another bat now, I've ripped that. You can sort of semi. Rip the bat in half by accident. Let me see. I'm trying to line it back up again, but I don't know. That tiny bit of cell tape I've got left might, if it's if it's sticky, might glue this tiny bit back together. So I've done it now. I need to have it blue tack on the back, but I won't be able to get through it. So I'm just gonna, it's going to be pretty much level to that bat over there. That's the key. I don't think I can even draw a bat, let alone just put one on here. Some people freestyle, templates are the way to go. I will insert last year's design because I've still got it. It's not. It's just literally a bat with a star and a moon. It's not quite this year's design. The actual bat on the other side looks like a bat. This one doesn't. But we live and we learn when we make mistakes. We had a whole carving um, kit last year. The only thing I can find was that scoopy thing. And I believe I used a spoon instead. The hard bit about this bat is actually getting the head, the head bit. Oh, I've just made a, I've just gone. I've gone. Oh, I've done it. But there's no head. I've done it without a head. It's sort of semi bat like, but I don't have a head. Now all I've got to do is sort of push it all through. You know, that is the next step, and basically, as soon as I've done that, we're done. So, I can basically show you, there are a tiny bit, few more, like, loose pieces I can do. I might wash that as well, I might not. I'm going to push it all through, and then we're done, and then you'll be back when I've completely finished it. That is the next step. My other video is now live, because it's gone four o'clock, but I need to put a light in it, but all I'm saying is, there's a lot of clearing up to do, but that'll have to do in when it's later. So it's semi worked. That's the happy. And we've got a bat there. And a bat there, and then it's Halloween. The problem is with these E's, this bit here, they were far too close. So we've kind of got one massive E rather than two. The end turned out alright. So I'm going to have to give it like, not a wash, but like a wipe down. And the lid fit, there's a gap there for some reason, so there must have been um, a piece that fell out. But all in all, as it says, now I need to turn my lights off. And actually, I might, I might have to wait for it to get dark, so I could do that when I get back from my run. But I'm going to get changed, and then if it's dark enough, we'll light it up and we'll see it. I might put it over there somewhere, away from all this gunk, so I could take a good photo of it as well. And yeah. And that was my design at the end because obviously all these pictures were cut out and they're the books I propped up on. But yeah, Halloween pumpkin carving. Success. I believe I must have used last year. So we've got some like Halloween cutters. Don't know whether I'm going to use them or not because tomorrow. Well, I'll have to do it tomorrow, won't I? But we've got cats. We've got skull. We have a ghost. We have a pumpkin. And we have a bat. But, don't know. I'm going to make some blueberry muffins. I've already filmed that. I was going to do that and not film it, but I could do blueberry cookies. I don't know whether that's really a thing, but I might not do cookies. But we'll see. Because it is almost Halloween. But I've only just found them. If I remembered, I could have done it last week with all my Halloween cakes and eating Halloween food. I could have made some biscuits or something. Anyway, not to worry. There's not enough light 
They can last forever, technically. But I don't think they're a really cool idea. But I had my pumpkin cake thing, didn't I, instead? There's actually all sorts of stuff. This is like the, um, like the baking drawer. And there's all sorts of things in here. Probably should tidy that up. But I've got Christmas sorted. Yeah, I probably should do a clear up. I've actually got the vamp. The vamp's cake tops down there. Anyway. I could do with sort of drawer out and maybe see what I've actually got in here. But yeah, that's the drawer. But these are the Halloween things that belong in that drawer. But I'll do something with these, I promise. Um, now I'm going to put a light in my pumpkin and show you last year's and this year's and see which one you like best. Look at that. I don't know whether you can see it. My deadly, deadly spider. Inside, it will change colour in a sec. Give it a sec. Look at that. That is found out. I took a few photos. I don't know whether it is better than last year because last year was simple and effective and it looks good. Where this year the design is better. But overall, it's pretty good. The one thing that isn't alright is that weather. I'm gonna get wet. So I best go because it's gonna get dark as well, but and then I peep you I peep you through the inside of it as well. Look at all that. Look how beautiful. That is pumpkin cover complete. Please like and subscribe and I will see you very very soon with another video and check out today's video if you haven't already.